Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. Let's continue the MS Excel VBA course tutorial series. Now in this video tutorial, I will explain how to get the column names from an SQL Server table using Power Query in Excel worksheet. So let's start the tutorial. And here we got the final outputs. Notice the column names only from SQL Server database table, student ID, student name and email which are this one student id student name and email only the column names i'm getting on this excel sheet if you are a first time visitor to my channel please subscribe to get the latest updates for this video tutorial i have created one new workbook the workbook name is the book one now i want to get the dynamically from a table column headers which are the column names of the table I want to display on my excel sheet only the column names not the data from an SQL Server table using a power query so in order to create a power query go to data and a data new query click that one from databases from SQL Server database and here we got the SQL Server database which prompts us to give the SQL Server name. It's asking our SQL Server name. So let's log into my, connect to my SQL Server database. I'm connecting my SQL Server database. This is my server name. Let's copy this one and connect. After that, uh, I'm expanding the databases, I'm expanding the Charan database as well as the tables of the Charan database. I'm expanding the tables folder. Now for this example, I'm taking and this student object table, student obj. Let's browse the table and here we got the records of this uh, table, student object, obj. Now my aim is I want to get only the column and student ID, student name and email, not the data, only the header section on my Excel sheet. So first we require our SQL server name. So let's add that one. So to get our SQL server name, notice the plug symbol, click that one. Here the server name, let's copy that one, cancel this thing. Again, switch over to our Excel sheet and pasting my server name. After that, we require the database name also. Our database name is a Charan database. Let's add the Charan database name. Charan. After that, in the advanced option, I want to get this student objects, student ID, student name and email, only the column names here. So the query is select column underscore name from information underscore schema dot columns 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 uh, where table name table underscore name is equals to now we need to give our table name between single quotes don't add double quotes use single quotes only and the table name is a student object obj student obj that's it so this is a statement to get the only the column name from the student object click ok and notice here we got the desktop the column name we are, here we got student ID, student name and email now i want to load this data on my desk on my excel sheet load to i'm selecting the table option and existing worksheet i want to display on the cell name a1 load the query is executed from the power query so here we got and here we got the final outputs notice the column names only from sql server database table student id student name and email which are this one student id student name and email only the column names i'm getting on this excel sheet thanks for watching this video tutorial in this video tutorial i have explained how to get the column names from an sql server table 
using the excel power query thanks for watching this video tutorial again please subscribe share and leave your valuable comment we'll catch you in my next video tutorial